All right, so Lizard Squad has apparently taken down the PlayStation Network of the PlayStation 3 and the PlayStation 4. Booting up my PS4 for the first time tonight. Just got done doing the Beastly Thought Show. Want to see if this is actually working or if they actually took this down. These people need to be stopped and prosecuted to the limits of the law. They need to be, bring back firing squads. Let's see. Oh, and just in case you guys haven't seen, this is the official PlayStation 1 um, theme. So let's see. PlayStation Store, is it up? A minute ago it said it was down for maintenance. It appears it... Let me see, let me see. Maybe it's down. Let's see if I can see any settings or anything. Um, yeah, all my friends are offline. PlayStation Network is down, apparently. Alright, so uh, the Lizard Squad, these, this band of rebels, these punk-ass dickheads, have taken out the PlayStation Network. And uh, this article is on express.co.uk. Sony hacker group claimed to have taken down the PSN, affecting the PlayStation 3 and PlayStation 4. Hacker group, see? Sony Entertainment Network is currently undergoing maintenance. I'm sure that they are. Maintenance for real. Uh, these big companies, Sony and Microsoft, need to employ better strategies for security. They need to have their own internal group of hackers that are able to see these kind of attacks before they come. It's like everybody is sitting there at a desk with a suit and nobody is able to stop this kind of stuff. If people can just go into a multi-billion dollar company and destroy their network with ease like this, a group of hackers, who is the person supposed to be stopping the hacker? Who's supposed to be stopping these people? And why does this keep happening over and over again? It's totally, totally... This just shouldn't happen. This is uh, unreasonable, and it's unacceptable. I think Sony and Microsoft need to really step the game up. Sony has been getting hit with this a little bit more than Microsoft, even though this same company took down Microsoft last week. But anyway, Lizard Squad are claiming to have taken down the PlayStation Network tonight, reportedly affecting both PS3 and 4 users. Fans started reporting problems logging into the service at around midnight UK time. The PlayStation Knowledge Center is still registering the service as being online, but the Express Online can confirm that access to the UK PlayStation Store from the PS4 is currently unavailable. As you guys can see, it's unavailable here in America as well. Online games such as Des Destiny continue to be unavailable, with an error message reading, unable to connect to PSN. Please check your network connection and PSN status. The PlayStation support team has confirmed they are looking into the current online issues. One fan wrote on Twitter, Looks like PSN is being DDoS currently. Going down. Sign in affected. And as you can see, you can't sign in. Lizard Squad has posted a link to all the comments regarding the PSN's online status, repeating what they did with the Xbox Live service in the early hours of Sunday morning. They followed the message up with PSN login, hashtag offline, hashtag Lizard Squad. And uh, it continues with a couple more tweets. I'll put a link in the description for you guys to check out this article. Uh, this is really unacceptable. Uh, it's unprecedented that uh, these major companies, Microsoft and Sony, have consistently been DDoS attacked by these by these hackers. I don't know if a DDoS attack can actually be stopped. I don't know. It's basically when you trick the servers into thinking that they have too much traffic and they, they crash. That's what these guys are doing. And I don't know if they can be tracked or how these people can actually be... Um, prosecuted. I think they should be prosecuted because the only people who are hurting are, people, are us. They're not really hurting Sony. Sony's not really going to lose any money. Microsoft's not going to lose any money. All they're doing is fucking up people's weekends. People who have to work 40 hours a week like myself who don't have a lot of time to play video games during the week. My only downtime is the weekend. And that's for a lot of people around the world who have to work and take care of families and support lifestyles. And you got a little bit of time on the weekend and you get a small group of dickheads like this Lizard Squad, which I'm just going to say right here on the internet, I don't like you guys. I don't like what you people stand for because it's like Robin Hood, but you're taking from the poor. You're stealing our ability to play our video games that we pay for, but at the same time, you probably come across or want to explain to people that you're doing it for the people against the companies. The only people you're hurting are the people. You're not hurting the company. Their money's still in the bank. You're not, you're not taking money out of their bank account. You're fucking up the services of people, good, hardworking people who play, pay, pay for these video games and want to play them on their, their downtime and their spare time. So the Lizard Squad can kiss my ass. I want you guys to know that from the bottom of my heart. And go ahead. I'm a, I'm a hard-working black man in America. I ain't got too much money, so go ahead and hack my account. If you do, please put some money in it. You guys let me know what you guys find out in the comment section below. And if you guys do see that Sony's uh, PlayStation Network is back up and running sometime soon, hit me up on Twitter. 
There's links down in the description to find me on Twitter. Follow me on Twitter. Check out the, the Beastly Gamer Facebook group. Do all that good stuff. I hope you guys enjoyed this informative video on a group of dickheads called The Lizard Squad. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time. Thank <laughs> you.